Hey skiers, it's Bob with SkiEssentials.com. Welcome to our 2023 ski test. Got a K2 Mindbender 90C for you today. Uh, this ski returns unchanged except for a slight graphics update, but still that same kind of awesome mid-range 90 millimeter underfoot ski that works well for a, a really wide range of skiers. Uh, kind of, you know, tucked in between the Mindbender 85 and the new 89Ti. Uh, this 90C has a sophisticated use of carbon uh, with a proven shape and profile. So it's a nice blend of, you know, kind of technology and simplicity. And we've really kind of liked this thing. We've gotten a ton of positive feedback from our testers over the years. And that carries through to 2023. So uh, good news for those skiers that are looking for that, you know, 88 to 90 millimeter underfoot all mountain ski. Uh, great choice here. We got an Aspen veneer wood core. And then we see the use of K2's carbon spectral braid. So the engineers at K2 are able to braid carbon stringers in a purposeful technique to kind of change and alter the torsional and longitudinal stiffness throughout the ski. Uh, we have tighter braiding up top through the shovel, uh, and then it kind of tapers in and gets wider at the bottom. So that gives uh, the ski you know, strong torsional stiffness where it's at its widest. So that'll kind of reduce the twisting of the ski, especially in the forebody, uh, the shovel here, uh, keeping it pretty minimal, you know, twisting through the underfoot area, and then a more playful tail. So easier release, uh, more fun coming out of the turns due to that kind of longer braiding, a uh, little bit less cross hatched across the ski and a little bit more longitudinal here towards the back. So a uh, very interesting way that K2 uses carbon in this ski. Uh, we also get their slant wall technology uh, that gives it a more uh, trapezoidal uh, feel on the sidewalls, allowing you to get better leverage, easier to get up on a higher edge angle in the ski. And you definitely feel that, you know, when you're kind of in that mid range of carver uh, speed and turn radius, uh, having this type of sidewall makes a pretty big difference in how easy it is to get up on the edge. And then we got that partial cap, partial sidewall construction. It does end to full cap in the very tips and tails here, uh, but that really just helps with swing weight. Um, but most of your edge grip is coming in that uh, vertical sidewall underfoot area here. So really giving it that nice boost in carving performance. Uh, this is the 177 here. Uh, we got it on the scale here at 1,715 grams. Uh, so pretty light, you know, I just had the uh, Mindbender 85 up here and the 170. Uh, coming in at about the same weight. So with a wider and longer ski, we're getting a reduced weight with this 90C. Kind of giving it, you know, that lends to that more sophisticated and technological use of materials in this 90C for sure. Uh, but really awesome choice for that intermediate to advanced skier. Not looking to work too hard to get their turns, but also want that uh, kind of upper end feeling of construction and sophistication. Uh, 17 and a half meter turn radius in this 177. So again, mid range, you know, if you're looking to open it up and make longer GS turns, it'll do that. Uh, if you're looking to tighten it up and really load up the tail, make some shorter, you know, slalom style turns, uh, no problem there as well. Very well rounded, uh, nice overall feel to this ski for anyone in that intermediate to advanced range who's looking for something pretty light, pretty manageable. Uh, and doesn't want to think too much about it. You know, if you're looking for a ski in this range and don't want to think too hard, uh, this is a pretty simple and safe choice with a nice high end. So check out this K2 Mindbender 90C at skiessentials.com and we'll see you out there on the hill. Bye.